What's going on guys? This is More Power 35 here. Welcome back to the channel. Today what I got for you guys is another Infinite Warfare video and what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be playing with a gun uh, that I feel like is a really good gun and could be one of the best guns in the game and that gun is going to be the ERAD. Ignore the the class names that I have, uh, especially for this one. This was not an SND uh, class setup. This is just a setup for the ERAD. Uh, what I'm going to be doing today is we're going to play with a common variant with a with the reflex sight, grip, quick draw, and fusion mag with a I believe that's a plasma grenade, ghost hardline, and marksman for my perks. So uh, without further ado, let's get into a game. Alright guys, so we're back. We're going to be on Skydog playing some TDM and we start out with a nasty, nasty kill with the ERAD. This is the gun that we're going to be using for this video today. This gun is an absolute machine. Oh, I should have had that guy. I'm going to try to go around and flank them and try to get these guys. Ah, uh, I, I probably shouldn't challenge that range with a sub, but I feel like this gun can hit people from that range. If not farther away, like I, I can see challenging, um, a sniper with an AR, but, oh my gosh, ah, uh, that MV4, that's got to be one of the better assault rifles in the game. Like, the best assault rifle I'll be doing a video on as soon as I unlock it and get a chance to actually get some attachments. Where did he go? Oh, what the heck? Oh, that was that little time warp ability where you can phase into another dimension for a few seconds. That was whacked out, dude. I forgot to mention the camo that I have on this gun. It's going to be the... Uh, Honeycomb camo, I actually unlock that for all my submachine guns, which what I really like about Infinite Warfare and the supply drops is once you unlock, you can unlock a weapon for a whole weapon category. Sit down, son. That's what I'm talking about. Like I said, this gun is a machine. It melts like butter. That's not an example of melting like butter, but you know what I mean. This gun is an absolute tank, dude. Oh, okay. Oh, what are you, what are you, what are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? They were all there. I, I really didn't have a shot at that. But I got as many of the kills as I could. Let's try to throw this grenade in there and see if I can get any of them. I got a hit marker. Oh, if I'd have kept, if I would have kept shooting, I would have killed the, that guy probably would have died against some of the other ones, but yeah, no. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing, mate? Oh, what the heck? I definitely walked right past that guy and didn't even see him. That's crazy, dude. I'm blind. Blind as a bat, ladies and gentlemen. You heard it here first. Okay, this guy's going around here. What are you doing? Just laying down. I don't know where the guy went. Yeah, I was trying to... I knew he was there. I just didn't know where he went. Looks like they're camping in that room. Let's see if I can get him with the... Where'd they go? I didn't kill them. Hmm. They must have pieced the scene. I want to do... Oh my gosh. Really? Really? Okay. Like I was saying, I want to do... There's a lot of guns in this game I want to do videos on. This... Seth was different about this game is actually... There's guns I want to do... Uh, a lot of guns I want to do videos on uh, in this game. Unlike Black Ops 3, there was only a, like two or three guns that I actually wanted to do videos on and I know I actually started YouTubing 
after Black Ops 3 had begun its life cycle. Oh, and the hip fire on this gun is great. Like, I, I can melt so many people at close range with the hip fire. That's why I think the sliding kills are going to be pretty... They're not going to be easy, but they're not going to be overly difficult to do. I'm not doing too bad. Got 11 kills with it. Oh, I need to get it. Three kills without dying. Well, I was one third of the way there on that one. I like doing these uh, challenges because they give you extra experience. It helps you level up. And I want to do a video when I hit my first prestige. Um, I haven't been playing this game too much. There's a guy over here. Really? Really? You have to lay down to kill me with a sniper rifle. Really? You need to reevaluate yourself. Enemy UIP. He's dead now. But he was alive. And he did kill me. But back to this gun. It's a great short to mid range gun. Um, it can even push into... Oh, I shouldn't have even jumped in there. It can even push into longer ranges if you can... If you can... If you have a steady aim... Oh, I got one. Thank God I got one. And didn't die. I mean, it would have been okay if I traded them, but... Throw that over there. It would have been okay if I traded them, but... I'm glad I got the kill and stayed alive. Okay, he ran it. He just... He pieced the scene. But like I was saying, this gun is really good in short range. Or this gun is great in short range. It's really good at mid-range. Oh, okay. You're going to go back here over here and lay down, aren't you? I am terrible. Oh, I am garbage. What was that? Really? OEG exposed. He can't shoot worth the crap. Oh, there we go. I got the mission complete. And I got a headshot. I feel like it... It takes a little while to get headshots, but that's going to do it, guys. Um, if you enjoyed this video, smash the like button. Let me know what you think of the ERAD and comment those in the comment section. If you're new to the channel, smash that subscribe button if you already have it. And as always, guys, I will catch you guys on the next video.